Pisces, welcome to Happy Soul Journey. So today we are going to look into your weekend's energy, like weekend, sorry, sorry, your weekly energy, week ahead messages for the week of 17th to 24th May 2021, okay? If you want a free reading with me, you can just comment below, love and blessings, and I'll take your entry. And at the end of the week, we will, I will just announce one person. Okay. Okay, Pisces. Feeling great? You know, I'm getting a feeling even if you are not having all the money or all the stability in your life, Pisces are feeling that it's about to, you are about to reach there. Pisces are getting a feeling like I'm about to reach there. Or for other part of you, like you are actually having it, like in the energy of manifestation. But uh, for a few, you are actually having it, like you are having stable relationship, a commitment in your life where you are happy, or a stable your own self. Like a few Pisces are working on uh, their personality, uh, working on their mental health, working on their self love. And they're feeling quite good and things are going on quite good here, okay? And you're trying to manifest your desires. Like you are working, you know, you're well on your pathway to it. And you, are know, you, you, you know that it will work out. You know, you have a sense that it will work out. And whatever you want, the desires will be fulfilled. And there's nothing more relaxed than that. Not even reaching there, okay? Empress reverse. So, yeah. Things are not there yet, okay? Things you will, for few Pisces, you will not see the growth in the coming week, okay? Growth in the coming week, but uh, I think it will happen, okay? I think it will happen. You will not see the growth. For few, like, universe don't want you to see the growth. Universe wants you to learn the lesson of faith and belief, Okay? So you will not see the growth, you will not see um, uh, the signs and this like you know that you are reaching there but I still am having a strong feeling that you will reach there. Okay, okay. Now who are you know for few of you maybe you will feel a little bit of uh, unstable on your part like uh, at your mindset you will feel like you know maybe you are making it making up or whatever you are saying or doing like you will have a little bit of doubt there or things will not work out like that but still you know i just want to say you one thing things will come okay health will be all right uh, if you are facing some kind of health issue that will be all right Okay, um, and uh, things will come. If you were uh, like single, then I'm seeing someone coming back from your past. It could be an ex or a friend, someone who you know, like you know, you have a feeling that you know that person. So that will come back for you in the love department. When it comes to like, I'm getting a feeling for health here, like you know. Some kind of health situation which will there is a scope of improvement. Okay, so whatever is coming for you, don't sabotage it because that has a potential. Even if you know you face some kind of bad situation in the past, like five of pentacles that someone left you or you felt misunderstood or you felt like this this is not working out this will not work out and now you decided to go for the other plan and you feel like maybe this will work out because now you have a feeling of like you know now this this will work out i'm going to do this 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 uh, but the something from past is some idea someone something some offer is coming out from the past which you feel like you know it will not work out that will be not the right decision but i think you need to really look into that thing because i think that has a different potential now okay and something different that you can learn from that thing 
Now this is a time when uh, the magician is not just energetically working. It is also physically working. Physically working towards the vision. I know, um, you know, for few of you, it the vision that you have, it, it is some kind of an impossible kind of thing or some uh, a road less traveled or something very different. Okay. But uh, I think you will walk on that irrespective of all those things because you have a sense of faith here okay and man i think i got one more card here i haven't i want to clarify the hand man High Priestess and Tower. Okay, so you are getting four major Akanas, guys, uh, for this story. And uh, Nine of Cups and Knight of Souls want to come as the under the deck energy. So I'm getting a feeling like this will be a very short duration where you feel stuck. And that is the duration when you will learn the most about the next step that you can take. And then the shift will be very, 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 very fast. Very fast towards whatever you want. Okay, shift will be very fast towards whatever you want. But that short duration could be two days, like one day or two day or three day. A very short period of duration where things will feel very, very stuck. Going nowhere. You don't know what's next, what to do. Uh, but that is the period that uh, will be uh, very wholesome of wisdom. Plus, you need to, uh, you know, follow your intuition. And intuition just talks in a whispers. You know, uh, I just give you an example. Uh, like, you know, sometimes what happens is like I'm watching some uh, series or something or some video which is like, it's not giving me anything like it's, it is not even entertaining okay so I internal voice say to me like uh, Chetna you should not do this right now you know you should do something else it's just very small whisper to me which my intuition is telling me I should not do this it is not right for me uh, or it is, it, it is of no benefit to me uh, it is like I'm just waste, wasting my energy and my time on this thing and uh, sometimes I listen to that and uh, uh, for, for a very long time I have uh, just ignored that voice. Like, you know, no, no, I'm, I'm liking it. But now I'm very mindful of whenever I'm watching us doing something, what I'm getting a feeling of. Like, you know, if, if my heart and if my inner voice say like, Chetna, you should not do this, then I stop doing that. Okay, and that is that that intuition and that whisper that inner voice comes out of like very calm place. Like you are very soothing, you're very relaxed, and you're just watching something, just doing something, you're in your tune and just you know everything is fine. And then your heart says you should not do this. You should hear that thing, buddy. You should hear that. Because that is your intuition telling you you should not do this. Just, you can do something better out with your time. Or there's something else which is waiting for you. If everything is fine in your heart and, and, and your heart is telling you, you should not do this or you should do this. You know, you are doing right. Sometimes, you know, there is some longer videos like 40 minutes video. And as an Aries, you know, you know, it's like everybody bash us that, you know, you have a very less sense of patience but you know I feel Aries are very patient people because when they know what they are going to get out of that long process Aries will go through the whole process no matter how hard how long and how harsh it will be Aries will go through the whole process just because they know what they are gonna get out of that process at the end of the video Sometimes I don't normally listen to 40 minutes or one hour readings or one hour video or when I don't know. But you know when my inner voice say you should hear this out. Then I listen to that 40 minutes, 50 minutes 
reading free 15 minutes videos so because my inner voice is telling me that you should do this initially i don't feel like you know i feel like uh, who will listen to all that thing and and, and you know initially don't, it don't attract me that much attractive to my uh, patience level sorry um, but uh, when my heart says like you know you should do this like give it a try i do that okay so the voice of your intuition the voice of your thing is very important and after that the shift will be very very fast towards your desire so it's very very small amount very very small amount of time that you need to struggle there but things will be fine things will be very very fine more than fine more than fine okay uh, fear will crop up guys for this group of pisces uh, uh, who are getting a rebound from the past or who are getting something out of, um, from the past some idea some um, direction some goals some person from the past yes things will you will feel the fear you will feel delusion you will feel like a sense of uncertainty you will feel like i should not do this it will not work out everything will be bad if it if, if it is like meeting someone uh, just like a person who you met in past and things didn't work out um, getting into a job or uh, doing something which is just like you did something in the past okay mercury retrograde is also there so just like which happened or someone in the past and things were not worked out i think you should not judge this experience with that experience because and you just you just need to take a leap of faith there okay don't juggle things because i i think things will work out or if things will not work out you are going to definitely learn a very something very uh, prominent uh, out of this experience so don't deny yourself this experience because something very prominent and some opportunity can come out of this experience no matter how 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 um you know how um imbalanced or uh, um unmotivated you are feeling for this to for this direction uh and the judgment so the work which you were putting on according to the desire that you had okay judgment will come judgment is coming for that thing okay for some reason i'm getting a feeling like things will not come out as you expected but it is not a ruin like it's not like everything every action everything that you put in uh, it was like it went into the waste it's not wasted yes things will and the result will not as per you desired or you envisioned or uh, you uh, like people do vis visualization for manifestation maybe you have visualized something things are or in desired will not come out as that but that doesn't mean that it's not good for you and it will not make you happy and all those things it 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 will okay it will to clarify the judgment be calm and relaxed have faith during when you are feeling bad ha huh, i want to have one more clarification here you know because the amount of energy and the amount of desires and the amount of belief that you put in and put in this thing things will not be at par with that oh 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 at par with that okay but just put on some an ointment on your wounds and uh, move forward like if that didn't work out that doesn't mean that you didn't got any kind of experience or any kind of thing that you know that's what the reasons that i i, I can feel after that put the ointment on your wound 
have some painkillers have some good time with the people you love more opportunities are coming if this was something with a person like a relationship then i think more opportunity will come as a page of cups early but then it will convert into the king of cups okay so fight 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 but if you are a little bit tired or if you are feeling a little bit demotivated then uh, take a break don't quit take a break uh, collect your uh, optimism collect all uh, the energy collect uh, the desires that you have and uh, go for the next thing get some kind of feelings there it could be that you had a very you know far sighted uh, like committed relationship with someone and you were like having fantasies and you were having uh, like your dreams with regards to that connection and then you will got to know something which is very hard breaking i'm not saying that you definitely face a breakup with this person or that kind of stuff i'm not seeing that but i'm seeing that there is definitely some heartbreak and definitely you need to have some moment where you feel like that's not what i wanted but collect yourself back guys because things will be fine things will be okay the next step that you will take after collecting yourself it will be more out of instinct maybe you have uh, ignored some red flag there in the past you were taking some kind of risk in the past you were uh, so into the passion and so into the energy of love or so into the energy of uh, your visions that you ignored a lot of stuff but uh, this thing was uh, i think much needed for you pisces this thing will make you feel like you know what are the things that you need to be mindful while you are walking on the path towards something or someone so that is very very much needed and uh, especially for me pisces and virgos should be very mindful when they get into a relationship i'm not saying that other people are so smart um but pisces and virgos are uh, very much uh, like they just get put themselves into the other person like put their life into the other person like they feel all the emotions so deep because they they think like you know um i don't know a very strong connection and they just give everything to that person all the emotions all the the dreams wishes and all those things the desire it, it involves that person as a very big part so yeah definitely that will hurt but you need to move on there is a song by so i think you should hear that the the song is carry on so that is like english song and it is like uh, carry on carry on i will i will think to you know put the link there in the description so go and watch that listen to that song okay so bye pisces on that note i hope this will make sense if you want a personal reading everything is in the description box below plus if you want a free reading with me then uh, you can uh, just comment love and blessing there in the description box below and I'll pick up your entry from there okay so that's for that Mwah, bye